Today we're going to learn how to do a simple backup copying your personal files and folders from your desktop computer onto a network drive or a network storage location. We're going to start by choosing the start button in the bottom left hand corner and we're going to choose computer. You'll then open up this screen here which we're going to place against the left hand side of the screen by grabbing the taskbar at the top and we're just going to bump it all the way over to the left hand side of the screen and it'll fill up that left hand side. I'm going to double click on this folder here or this drive here which is my C drive. I'm going to choose the subfolder called users or user. Then I'm going to find the one down here that basically has my username. In my case here mine is BP Owens. These belong to other individuals that have logged onto my computer at some point in time. This is the folder I want to back up. I want to back it up in its entirety. Before we go ahead and back it up, I'm going to take a quick look inside so you can see what it has. It has my email contacts. It has all the files that are on my desktop, files that I've downloaded. I also have a Dropbox link. Favorites. That's the favorites on my web browser, in this case both Microsoft Explorer and Netscape Navigator. My links. It has everything inside the My Documents folder my music, my photos, my videos. I also have a link to my OneDrive, which is Microsoft's new network drive. Uh, save games, there's nothing in there, but there'll probably be a folder there for you. Um, my search, don't know what this folder is for, really don't care what this one is for, or for that matter, those two, but we're going to back them up anyways. So I'm going to go ahead and go back to where it was. You don't need to look inside like I did, but this is the folder again that we're going to back up. So to get there again, real quickly, we're going to show you Start button, Computer, C Drive, Users, and then again to get it to one side of the screen, we're just going to bump it up against the edge and it'll fill up half the screen. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to go to our network drive by going to Start, Computer, the network drive is identified by your username. It's located on Send Staff, in my case, A1 Staff folder. I'm going to double click there. And I'm going to bump this up against the left hand side of the screen. Now, all I need to do is click on my user folder that is on my local computer and drag it over here to my network drive. And it'll take a moment. As a matter of fact, in this case, it's telling me that it's moving quite a bit here 13.2 gig or more. That's the first and easiest way to do it. It'll be on a network drive that gets re-imaged, I'm sorry, not re-imaged, but backed up and restored on a district level on a regular basis. 